back to another video. Today in this video I'm going to be playing Shovelware's Brain Game. Um, this has been really popular at the moment and it, it looks amazing. Kind of like Arnold Bam Bam, <laughs> um, which we played the other day. Look at these pictures. Like they look really exciting. So I'm really excited to play this game. You've got an entertaining audience, as it says on the picture. Entertaining prizes. Entertaining guests. And some new prizes, podiums, and more. Let's get into this. Shovel Bear's Brain Game. Yeah! Ooh. Shovel Bear's Brain Game. This game features voice acting. Player sound on is recommended. Uh, I'll, I'll do this one. Another exciting Whoa. episode of Shovelware's Brain Games. Stay tuned. We'll be right back ha. after these messages. Whoa, look at it. Wait, this game actually looks good. Why does this game actually look good? <laughs> this episode of Shovelware's Brain Hello. Games. Hello. Hello there, sir. Um, how are you doing there, sir? Swampy prices. Hello, sir. Donut man. Hello, sir. How are you doing? Ooh, there's a green guy. Green guy. Green guy, can I hug you, green guy? I wanna hug you, I wanna hug you. Green guy, green guy, green guy. Oh, oh and also, just to let you know, if I am bad at this, um, which I probably will be, um, it is probably gonna be normal for me, because the, these questions in this game are very hard. So I'll probably get it wrong. I'm just letting you know that. Don't know why. Right, right, let's go. <laughs> Starting in 12 no, that's that's 68 seconds. Song time. Nephew graphic tea, brain game tea, dancing banana tea. <laughs> show game show host banana tea. No, I don't want it. Why is some <laughs> What has happened? Oh, it's starting now. Look at this audience. This game is amazing. And I'm gonna look at this, sir. Uh, sir, I can't go in first person. Sir, I would like to inform you. <laughs> look, look at this. Oh, donut man. Donut man. Right. Well, let's go, let's go do this. Starting in 16 seconds. I'm gonna jump around, look at everything, and I'm gonna go on there. It's cameras. All right, so I'm in seven seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Way! Oh, what happened? Oh, we're here. Where am I? Oh, look at the audience. There's, mm, there's white chocolate, there's sweets. For fans of vaguely educational content, Ooh. don't touch that dial. It's time for Shovelware's Brain Game. Whoa. <laughs> this is going to be awesome. He's got smiles for miles. It's your host, The Dancing Banana. Way. Hey, buddy. Hello. What has ordered me to appear before you today? So hello, thanks for tuning in. Happy to have you here. What category do you want? So this is like a game show, is it? Choose a cate category. Taste test? I don't like that. I'm big Taste laundry. test. Right, guess we're doing taste test. It's time for a taste test. How much do you know about food? There was a US know. Supreme Court case in 1893 that determined that a certain food item should be classified as a vegetable, even though it's botanically well, defined as a fruit. Well, what could that what be? What food item was the topic of debate in that case? Ah. Uh, grape? <laughs> oh, no, 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 it's cucumber. No. It's cucumber, I think. Yeah, I suck at this. It's cucumber. Yeah, it's cucumber. Oh, it's tomato. 
Uh, I said nothing. I know I suck. Welcome to the game. Oh, I, didn't, I didn't get to read it. Amazing space. Talking about states or probably geography. What are you going to pick, lady? Probably geography. Okay. We'll find out if you know geography in this category. Probably. I've been looking to sneak in a little me time and get myself some much needed R&R. &R. Mm -hmm. I want to go somewhere without many people around. Seriously, the fewer the better. Okay. Which continent is the least populated? I don't know. Antarctica. I think. I think it must be. Good enough! Yes! Ooh, your boy's smart! <laughs> Funny. I don't know if the residents would let the announcer chill there, but I thought the, the pioneers were some clubs. Hey, thanks for joining us. Pick a category. Any. Probably geography again. Big laundry and shovelware stores. Big laundry. Okay. Alright, let's air out some of this big laundry with the big laundry category. Because my pen pal from Japan helps fill in for her mother at the inn they run, she's often wearing a specific type of traditional clothing. It's also is the national now? dress of the country. What is it? I'm just going to guess. I don't know this. Yukata? That's right. Yeah, I knew I'd get it wrong anyways. Kimono, that's a weird name. She's wearing kimono because she's feeling for her mom. Okay, but it's my turn. Welcome to the game. Ready to choose a category. Hey right, guys, what would you choose? Monumental landmarks, memorable events, flags of the world. A, A. Flags of oh, the world. It picked, it picked for me because I didn't pick. Let's see how much you know about the flags that represent nations all over the world. Yeah, I didn't pick that. I, it just From did for me. From left to right, in which I order click? are the three prominent colors on Mexico's flag? This? I don't know. I'm not like a big like flags of the world person. I don't know everything. Awesome! Yes! Booyah! Your boy's got brain cells! Your boy's smart! Just like the Italian flag, except Mexico's got you a, know, something I was I just reminded of. What the? What is this? GW6 public access, 7 pm. You put in the effort oh. and you run. I mean, those are really difficult hobbies that I. Slime field. <laughs> It's like a comedy show. And so if no! anybody wants to trade up, uh, I'm, I'm around. Oh, now I'm hungry. I don't blame you for changing the channel. I wasn't paying attention either. That's funny. Welcome to the game. Ready to choose a category? Monumental landmarks, artistic integrity, and taste test. What are you going to pick, lady? What are you going to pick? Taste test. We're so close to food lady Coffee is made I can by roasting it. and blending a certain something. What is that certain something? I don't know. Oh, yeah, some coffee grains. Or is it coffee beans? I remember um, I remember it being coffee grains. I don't think I'm right. Oh, that's just plain wrong. He, she got it wrong. It's coffee beans. Yeah. I'm stupid. Why did I say coffee grain? <laughs> Probably geography, flags of the world, talking about states. Who flags knows? of the world. Flags of the world, okay. Let's see how much you know about the flags that represent nations all over the world. What are you doing, little banana? You're a little bit sketchy. We've got a very Ooh. special guest backstage. Come on out, Bordy! Bordy! Hiya, hiya, hiya! Ready for your question? Of course I am, Bordy. Take a look at this flag. Which country does it belong to? Mm. Argentina. I think, I think, I think. It's a sad... See, I told you it would be hard questions. I told you. 
So I'm not going to get all these right. Oh, no mark. Oh. Yeah! Yeah, boys. Well, I did. Yeah, boys, smart. Oh, know. bye. Bye, buddy. Look at buddy in all the scrolling. <laughs> Some reason I find I find I feel like the banana's a bit sketchy. Shovelware Studios. Cause when you hear shovelware, you think quiz questions. Do there I? There are many objects and items to find and absorb in Shovelware's Super Slime Simulator. Which Ew. of the following is not found somewhere in the yard area? I don't know. I'm not. I don't play shovelware. I don't even. Um. Sure, whatever. Yeah, it's a fork. Right? Like, yeah, you find the fork at the end of the orb, don't you? Yeah, I'm right. Wait, I actually got it right. I actually got it right. See, your boy's smart. You're up to bat again. What category will it be? Hmm. Just category. Talking about states, artistic integrity, memorable, memorable events. events. I guess doing memorable events. Let's explore the mysteries of history. The Confederate States of America was a group of states that seceded from the United States over a dispute primarily about wanting to maintain slavery. Oh. On April 12th, 1861, those nut jobs waged a civil war against the United States of America that they ultimately lost, and oh. 3.9 million enslaved people were freed as a result. How long did their little temper tantrum last? I don't know. Four years? One year after World War II died? Hmm. That's pretty based. Yes! Woohoo! I don't know how I'm getting this crap, but I am, so. <laughs> Go ahead, you should advise the simple method of choice a bigger category. It's easy. It's my turn, I guess. Um, nonsense, non sequiturs, it's lit fam, eyes on the... Eyes on the prizes? Eyes on the prizes. Of course I'm getting that. I need those prizes. What is the name of the neighbor I'm hoping to shut up by showing off my very expensive grill from Dinkman? I don't know. Uh, Barney? Barney the dinosaur lives next to your house. Can't say that, ah. Uh, why? I'm just talking about Barney. Why is Barney not allowed on TV? Dog. Rubbish. Rubbish, I say. My professional critical opinion is that this show stinks. And I am taking my leave of it. Good day, sir. Okay, there's a gear shop on your right just past the exit. A gear shop? Oh, I just love gift shops. I simply can't get enough of Rapid Cop Super Race. And, oh, I can't wait. Will you pick a category just at the time I run out? Oh, I want to know. Of course she will. I hope. What if she doesn't do it? Science rules. Uh, uh, uh. She picks science rules. I... I'm on the roller coaster here at Shovelware Studios Hollywood. As we go uphill, Whoa. we're building a bunch yeah. of potential energy. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, it's so high. The what type of energy is that converted to as we start to roll down? Ah. Uh, kinetic. <laughs> I don't know, I'm just guessing. False. She got it wrong. I got it right! Like, I'm the only one that got it right on that. Doing well. Science rules. It's lit fam and amazing space. Amazing space. I wonder what it's lit fam is. How sweet the sound. We'll be taking about out of space in this category. Okay, okay, I'll ask him. So my little alien friend Glup is trying to get back to their home planet on the other side of the universe. But they're worried the spaceship won't make it past all those space rocks orbiting between Mars and Jupiter. Do you know what that region of the solar system is called? I'm hoping I can find a library book on it so we can figure out the odds of navigating through it. I think I know. I think it's the asteroid belt. I know my space. Your boy knows his space. 
It's the asteroid belt. False. I hear got it false. See, your boy knows space. The asteroid belt. Your turn to answer another question. What category will this question be from? Wait, there's seven seconds. Big left. laundry. Oh, wait, what was that time? Whatever that means, let's see the question. In wrestling, there's a move in which one wrestler runs at the other, holding their arm out beside them, knocking them over. It shares its name with a tool used Ooh. in the process of drying laundry. What is it? Um, clothesline? I think. No, I'm not, I'm really not sure. No way! Yeah! I'm doing so good! Your boy's big brain. It's uh, as I'm, I, I, wait, no, it's not my turn. I thought it was my turn. Flags of the world. Flags of the world. Let's keep the flag flying with this flags of the world category. Here on behalf of Smart Technologies, it's 40, 40 the Smart Smartboard. smartboard. Hi, Bordy. My flight leaves in an hour, but here I am. <laughs> Take a look at this flag. Which country does it belong to? Oh, I know that. I know it's Antarctica. It's Antarctica. Your boy's big brain. I hope. Oh, my small brain. I might a little peanut, little peanut brain. Little, little, little peanut brain. Peanut, the peanut. Yes, yes, I got it right. I got it. Right. I've got seventy for that too. I'm gonna, I, I think I'm gonna win this. I think I'm gonna win this round. I've got seventy-two points. Go ahead, use your devices and put method off. To a speaker category, it's easy. Really now? Monumental, Monumental landmarks. landmarks. That's what I pick. Daunting, non representational maps everywhere. It's monumental landmarks. Cool. We know you love him. Here it's him. Portia He's again. Board. He's back. Kept you waiting, huh? Here's a question from me to you. So we see Bordy so much look this, at this round. Photograph. Yeah. Look it is a famous landmark. I what know what it name? is. I'm going to win. I actually don't know. I don't know that one. I, I, I don't know that one. Your boy's not big brain on that one. Shoot, not your dear, I guess. No. Wah, wah, wah. The pyramid well, of Catherine. Well, my duties. Bye for now. Bye. Bye, smart. Bye, sm body. And so another round has come to an end. One of our lucky contestants will be leaving here today with Fabius prize. Let's see what it will be. Oh, I really want to win it. What's the prize, my boy? A new card! Oh. It's an ace of spades. But I thought he was going to say it's a new card, but it's a new card, duh. You did it! You I got win! The biggest breed of all. I know! Look at it grow! Don't touch that Way. Well, the Wears Brain Game will be back with another episode after a short break. Wow! Yes! I win! The Wears Brain Game is brought to you by. Aha! Top of the line in technology and. Your boy's the best! Your boy's the best! Wow! Hi! Whoa! Hi! Bye! So, um, that was a really good game. Your boy won, as always, and I will see you in the next one. Peace! Oh, and make sure to subscribe and like the video. Turn that and click that bell so you never miss a video and peace. <laughs>